Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today's video is just going to be a non face cam video. It's going to be a very quick and easy tutorial on how to fix your game. Every single time you launch your game, for some reason, it's in full screen borderless and either at 66% or at 80% render resolution. I don't really know why this happens. It's it's a very annoying bug that definitely needs to fix. It's been inside of Warzone since the literal release date. And the devs just really don't care about it whatsoever, so they just leave it in the game. And the only way to fix it is by doing these simple steps I'm about to show you. But before we do the steps, I'm going to show you guys what happens and exactly how to see if this is your issue. Again, if this isn't your issue, there's probably another fix out there. But this is just if game launches in 66% render resolution and in full screen borderless instead of 100% render resolution or whatever your render resolution is. And your uh full screen borderless so as you guys can see i just launched my game and i'm going to go ahead and open up warzone and as you guys can see the, the game looks awful the, uh, just all the settings are wrong so we'll go into graphics and we'll see whatever reason they have full screen borderless and render resolution on 66 percent and full screen borderless for some reason selected sometimes you'll go down here and these settings will be messed up but more often than not it's just going to be these and so what you're going to want to do is make sure you set your render resolution to what your 100 is or whatever you'd like to have it set at for me i just play on 1920 by 1080 and obviously full screen for the better fps performance now it depends on your rig but for me i get better fps when i'm playing on full screen some people get better fps on borderless whatever but for me i do better on full screen so go ahead go ahead and apply those settings and you are good to go on that end um so basically what you can do is you can just you can just alt tab and you can go down to your file explorer if you don't see that here you can stop pinning your taskbar you just go here you type in file or into this anyway um you pull that up and you go to your documents and you go to call of duty modern warfare players and you should see these folders here now and these files excuse me um now you'll you'll see this config.zip file and config dash number file uh both of these you just highlight and these for some reason cause the issue not really too sure why that's i just know that's caused the issue and you'll see these two folders on top here you'll see config.cfg the notepad not the zip file remember the notepad file you don't want to delete the notepad file you want to delete the zip file but well, you'll know that the zip file will have this and a zip or if you have winrar i'll show you here in my, in my uh, recycle bin it will have that make sure you do not delete config.cfg uh, you do config.zip dash make sure those are what you so in here you will have um this is your settings. This is like your main graphic settings. Now, as you can see, this has basically all the settings. See, it has what we want. Um, full screen. Then it has your custom FPS, what you want, stuff like that. You don't want to modify this. Um, this just shows. It, it it just makes sure you know this is where all your settings are held, basically. And you guys can see this is where my graphics card is, stuff like that. So basically, what you want to do is you want to right click on this, go to properties. And then make sure this is on read only now the reason you want to make sure it's on read only is that the game for some reason when it launches decides to change this because it's not on read only so you want to make sure this the attributes are set to read only click apply now this these are basically your key binds and whatever this is you can leave this on whatever um some people say to make this on read only do what you want i choose just to leave it as it is um as it's not really a cfg file so they can't or yeah, CFG file, so they can't really change it. So, um, yeah. And basically, that is that is it. Now, I'm going to go ahead. Now, I'm going to go ahead and restart my game to show you guys that this does, in fact, work. So, I'll quit the desktop. And we just relaunch the game. We'll go to play. And this will be to prove that this fixes your game entirely. So, you'll see you'll launch your game. And it'll look good. Everything will be great. Options, graphics, full screen, screen refresh rate, 240. Again, nothing changed down here. It's just these settings that get reset every time. Again, if this got, if this did help, 
guys by any means be sure to leave a like be sure to share with your friends if you guys are having this annoying issue uh, i do stream on twitch twitch.tv slash itriz i do all sorts of content covering warzone news updates gameplay funny moments stuff all all that I, I hope you guys did enjoy this video i hope it did help you if you did please be sure to leave that sub it means a lot to me leave the like i hope you guys enjoyed this video like i said again thank you guys so much for watching peace out and have a happy new year